guys, I'm Veronica. I'm Vanessa. And today we are going to be doing something a little different, but before we do that, make sure to subscribe to our channel if you are new. And give this video a thumbs up, and we post new videos every single Tuesday, so just always come back Tuesday to watch our videos. For this video, we are going to be recreating a Webtoon comic. For those of you who don't know what Webtoon is, it is an app where there are free comics that you can read and they're uploaded daily. There are so many types of different stories and genres. I've had this app for the longest time <laughs> and I've been wanting to do this idea of recreating a story from the app for the longest time. So I'm really, really excited about this. If you love comics, you should definitely download this app. Uh, we love reading comic books, so it's really fun to just swipe through and just read them, and it's really easy to. So we're going to recreate chapter one of Let's Play, and if you guys want to read the rest of the story, you can only read it on Webtoon. So get the app and read it, and there's a bunch of other stories, and yeah. We'll put a link in the description below so you guys can go download the app for free. Now, let's get on with chapter one of Let's Play, written and created by Mongi. When I was little, I fell in love with gaming. The genre never mattered. The thought of playing as a hero or solving a puzzle awed my young mind. By my teens, I gamed competitively, though I lacked what it took to play professionally. In college, I earned my degree in computer science. In school, I worked diligently on creating my first indie game. I spent countless hours working on it, missing out on nights out with friends. Sam, come party with us! <sighs> working nights on my game and going to classes in the day. After college, I submitted my new indie game, Ruminate, to the independent game website, Indigineer. On this website, new developers can gain a following and get their name out. If you gain a large enough fan base, you might get scouted by a large game company. Ruminate was posted on Indigineer for a month and the feedback was mostly positive. My developer score was 8.2 out of 10. This was a great score to have for my first game. I had hoped that by being on Indigineer, a game company might offer me a job in game development. Unfortunately, things haven't quite worked out that way. All right, that Minotaur was too tough for me. Mistakes were made, I admit. Even if I beat that Minotaur, I still have to escape the maze, and I'm not going to level up unless I kill something. The monsters in this world are really strong, but there's a few goblins over here, and I'll use the sword to get them. How about you? Um, problem? Ow, that's a lot of sharp objects in tender places. I think it's safe to say this is the end of the mini law man. And since I have yet to see any place to save my game, this is the end of my attempt at playing Ruminate. Before I finish this video, if the developer of the game watches this, I understand you said this is your first game, but it is currently not playable like this. You're going to anger your players if you put monsters in the world with no way to defeat them. And they'll really hate the game if you don't give them a way to save their progress. What I'm saying is, this game needs a lot of work. I have played a lot of good and bad games as a VTuber. But I've never played a game where I struggled to progress more than I did in this game. I can tell you tried hard on this game and you're offering it for free. But you should get more critique on a game before you post it for people to play. Until then, good luck. I guess this is a good point to end the video, but before I close, I want to tell you guys that I'm moving! Because of this, I'll be pretty busy over the next few days and might not be able to upload videos on my normal schedule. Don't worry, there'll still be two videos posted a day. And once I moved in, I'll give you guys the grand tour. But not too much. I don't need any more Amorous fans finding out where I live and showing up at my door again. As always, thank you for watching, and this is Martial Law signing out. It seemed as though my career as a developer was already over before it had truly started. Okay, okay, calm down, Bowser. Just you're, be careful, you're gonna trip me. Just let me lock the door first. Is someone moving in next door? I wonder who it is. 
I guess I'll bump into them eventually. I hope they're nice and quiet. <laughs> oh man, I didn't see you there. Are you all right? His voice, it sounds familiar. Miss, are you okay? <gasps> um, problem? And that was us recreating the first chapter of Let's Play. I know we had a lot of fun making this. Let us know if you want to see us continue recreating it or recreate a different webtoon, comic. All the links will be in the description below. Also, make sure to finish the story Let's Play. Actually, it's not finished yet. The writer is still uploading weekly. So I'm, I'm waiting for more well, episodes to be updated. I need to waiting. know what happens to Sam and who she falls in love with. Dun, dun, dun. Dun. <laughs> Jeez, no, it's a really good story. You guys should read it, and there's a bunch of other really cool stories as well. I'm a huge fan of the app, and just I really like just reading the comics. Me so. too. <laughs> so yeah, make sure to download the Webtoon app, and thanks for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe to our channel by clicking this button right here. And if you click this circle button right here, you can subscribe to our second channel. Check out some of the other videos we've done, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.